Hello everyone, welcome to Aptitude Jab. This is a set based on arrangement. It says that there are eight students of a class. They live in a street where the houses are numbered one to eight from right to left. Okay, and uh, the roll number of these students is a square of these numbers, and it is different from uh, the house number in which the person lives. Right. So it is. Let's say a person lives on house number three. His square might be his roll number might be square of five. Okay, so it is saying that uh, like square of the house number in which some other student lives. Okay, so uh, and uh, then certain conditions are given to us. Okay, so we'll get a table like this. So maybe we will get multiple cases for that. I have drawn a bigger table. <coughs> uh, if you see these statements. Okay, if you see these statements, uh, is there anything which is giving about a fixed position? That it says the person whose roll number is the square of the house number in which Renu lives lives on the leftmost house. Okay, so leftmost person is the one whose house number is square of Renu's house. Okay, and then another statement about that leftmost person is. The difference between the roll number of the person living on the leftmost house and the person living on the fourth house is 24. Now these students have roll numbers 1 to 8, so their squares will be 1, 4. The roll numbers will be these are house numbers. Roll numbers will be these. Okay. Now 24 is the difference. Okay. 24 is the difference which exists between 125 okay and uh, then you have 25 and 49 so there are two possibilities now it says that the person living on the uh, the difference between the roll number of the person living on the leftmost leftmost house and the person living on fourth house is 24 so leftmost is this so it can be 1 and 25 okay so let us leave this line for name then it can be 25 and 1 right it could be 25 and 49 right difference is 24 or it could be 49 and 25 okay so this is the difference between roll number of the person living in the leftmost and fourth house now we are also given the leftmost person is uh the person whose roll number is square of the uh, house number on which renu lives okay so leftmost is renu and this so let us keep marking the sentences that we have been using so it is square of renu okay so that means renu lives on one as per this renu lives in the fifth one right again renu lives in the fifth one renu lives in the seventh house okay okay and uh, now another mention of renu here three people live between renu and the person whose roll number is 16 okay so now it becomes easy one two three this person will be 16 okay you cannot have three people here one two three this person is roll number 16 again this person roll number 16 and one two three this person roll number 16 okay next it says there is another connection with 16 so we need to connect the dots okay so uh, we have connected renu and 16 now 16 is mentioned here so the roll number of veena is a multiple of 3 and she lives on an even numbered house immediately left of the person whose roll number is 16 okay so uh, veena is to the immediate left so this will be veena okay and uh, her house number is a multiple of 3. Now, what are the multiples of 3? 9, 36. So it could be 9 or 36. Okay. So, uh, in this case, it is not possible because, uh, like, uh, it is living on even numbered house, right? Veena is on the immediate left and she is on an even numbered house. So, this means this case is not possible. Wait, this 16 is not here. 16 is actually 
uh, one two three people and then this is 60 so these are uh, quite much possible okay so this is bina with 9 or 36 let us check once again if we did any other mistake also one two three yes so that is fine okay now in this case uh, this is 16 and this is uh, this person cannot be bina okay so this is not possible you can eliminate this case as of now we are left with three cases okay so this is done now what are the numbers statement remaining uh, Neeraj lives immediately left of Ishani and both have a roll number which is a multiple of 4 but not 9. Multiple of 4 but not 9 is what? 4, 16, 64. Okay. Anyway, we have already filled 16. Okay. And 16 cannot be neighbor of uh, any of these. Right. So 4 and 64. Then it says that uh, the roll number of Ishani is higher than the roll number of Neeraj. So it says Neeraj lives on the left of Ishani. So Neeraj and Ishani. And it is saying that roll number of Ishani is higher than the roll number of Neeraj. So we will have 4 and 64 coming in consecutive places. Okay. Now 4 and 64 come uh, can come in these two places only. 4 and 64. And they have to be Neeraj and Ishani 464 Neeraj Ishani. Okay. In this case, we can have 4 and 64 like this Neeraj Ishani. And this case also we can have Neeraj and Ishani. Okay. So this is done. Okay. And uh, The roll number of Genu is the square of the house number in which Ishani lives. Okay, so Ishani lives on 2 and Genu should be 4. So this is not possible. Okay, Ishani lives on 6. So Genu should be 36. And in this case also, Genu should be 36. So Genu is 36. Okay, so this Bina must be 9. Bina has to be 9, she cannot be 36. Okay, so we know that Gino is 36 from these two cases. And where to put Gino? The only possibility is here because either we have the roll numbers or we have the names. So this will be 36 and Gino. This is 36 and Gino, right? So we are left with uh, one uh, roll number which is in this case 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 so will be 49 and in this case 1 is left and what else is given to us is uh, Uday lives to the right of Gita but to the left of Anuj so Uday is in between right of Gita so this will be Gita and this will be Anuj so we get two possibilities for this arrangement okay and uh, almost all of uh, the other conditions other things are same just that these two people uh, we cannot figure out their roll numbers right we can find the order for all but roll number for two people right so we get two cases for how many of the given students can their roll numbers be identified so for six people we can identify the roll numbers for two people it is uncertain what is Anuj's roll number? Anuj's roll number in either case is 16. Which of the following statements is false? There are two pairs of students that live adjacent and have the roll numbers as squares of consecutive numbers. Let us check in each case. 5, 2, 8, 7. Now in this case, this is possible. Okay. And 9 and 16. So two pairs. If you take this case, this is 7, 6. 3, 4. So in either case, you have two pairs, right? So that is not false. That is true because in either case, if you take, there will be exactly two pairs. The sum of the roll numbers of the students living in the central two houses is 50. Yes, 49 and 1. These are the central two persons. So that is also true. Gita's roll number is an odd number. Uh, Gita's roll number is odd. So that should be incorrect. Genus uh, lives on an odd numbered house. Yes, she lived on an odd number house and her roll number is also odd. Her roll number is even. Okay, so that is false statement. 
if there are two houses between the students that have the lowest two roll numbers what is udit's roll number okay so lowest two roll numbers are 1 and 4 okay so two houses between them so we will consider this scenario okay because 1 2 and this is and then in that case udit's it is asking udit's roll number right so two houses between them and udit's roll number is 1 in that case so uh, this is uh, the solution to the arrangement and the answers to the questions related to it.